Good day viewers and you are welcome. You want to find the value of a that satisfies this problem given that a multiplied by a multiplied by a multiplied by a divided by a plus a plus a plus a equals 6. To solve this, we are going to multiply all this a together. So when a multiply here, we have it as a square. Then a is multiplied by the second a divided by a plus a is given as 2a plus a equals 6. And next, when we multiply a squared by a, we have it as a raised to the power of 3 divided by 2a plus a is given as 3a equals 6. So next, we are going to cross multiply. So when we cross multiply, we have a raised to the power 3 equals 6 multiplied by 3a. So next we have a raised to the power of 3 equals 6 multiplied by 3 is given as 18, then we have a. So having this, we take 18a to the left hand side and we have a raised to the power of 3 minus 18a equals 0. So having this value, we are going to factor out a since we have a here and we have a here as well, which are factorizable. So by factoring out a, we have a raised to the power 2 minus 18 equals 0. So by rule of quadratic, it means we are going to let a equals 0 or for the second part, we consider our a square minus 18 equals 0. a square minus 18 equals 0. So to have the full solution to this, we are going to consider from this 18. The 18 can be written as 9 multiplied by 2, everything equals 0. Then, if you have this as a square minus, we know 3 square is given as 9, then multiply by, if I have this as square root of 2, all raised to the power of 2 is given as 2 as well. So, here is having square is having square. We can combine these together and we have a square minus 3 root 2 all square equals 0. So 3 root 2 all square is still given as 18. Then here is a difference of 2 square. And we have this kind of expression a square minus 3 root 2 square. We are going to write it as a minus 3 root 2 in bracket. Then we also consider the positive part, which is a plus 3 root 2 equals 0. And then we have a minus 3 root 2 equals 0. Or we consider the second one, which is a plus 3 root 2 equals 0. So here we have a equals 3 root 2, and the other one is a equals minus 3 root 2. For the first one we get, which is a equals 0, let's try to verify that. When we verify at a equals 0, and we try to substitute it in the problem, which is a multiplied by a, multiply by a divided by a plus a plus a so equals 6 when we substitute 0 as a value so every here becomes 0 and the derivative also becomes 0 but 0 divided by 0 it is uh, undefined so therefore at a equals to 0 is a rejected value 
So we reject it and uh, we only consider when a equals 3 root 2 and uh, when a equals minus 3 root 2. I believe these two solutions will satisfy the problem when we substitute it. And that's how to do it. Thanks for watching. And if you are new here and find this video interesting, please try to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more videos. See you in the next class. Never stop learning. Bye-bye.